okay, which lawyer proposed this plea deal and why didn't it go anywhere? Yeah, this is veteran Florida litigator Chris Keis, who proposed this deal to other Trump advisors who then floated it to the former president when he first was hired onto the team last year. It was uh, quickly shot down and shortly thereafter, uh, he was actually alienated and sort of pushed aside and sidelined from the Mar-a-Lago documents case and has since sort of been handling all of the other criminal cases that Trump is facing. But we did get, catch a glimpse of Keis this week, who actually accompanied Trump in Florida for his uh, arraignment, uh, which was a, a bit unexpected. But uh, Trump has had a bit of trouble finding Florida-based counsel to help him with the this next phase uh, of the Mar-a-Lago documents case as he's now facing 37 charges uh, against him for mishandling, concealing, uh, and obstructing the Justice Department's efforts to recover these documents. Um, but it, it really shouldn't come as, as much of a surprise that the former president turned down uh, the effort on behalf of, of Kais and maybe some of his other lawyers to try to take a more cooperative stance towards the Justice Department um, as this this would be a, a bit unusual for for the the posture both publicly and privately Trump has taken towards these myriad investigations.